Hi, my name is Yannan Lee and I'm a scientist and a PhD student here at the University of Hull. Unlike most scientists you see depicted in the media, you'll notice that I'm wearing a wet lab coat. And this is due to the work I do and what I specialise in, which is radiation. Now, often when I tell my friends and family about what I do here and the research that I'm conducting, they have this negative connotation with the word radiation. It, they conjure up images of nuclear disasters or bad comic book villains, but really, radiation is a fantastic tool we have with our fight for cancer. Now, unfortunately, cancer is an issue that affects most people at some point in their lives, either yourself or someone you love and care about. And this is where the work of scientists, doctors and nurses is hugely important, as currently more and more people than ever before are being cured. And this is thanks to one of the real things that interests me about science is innovation. What we are doing now would not be possible mere 10 years ago. So it holds so much wonder, what would it bring in the future? These are all really important stories and specific areas that would need to be highlighted. Particularly at the moment, a key issue affecting scientists in Great Britain is the EU referendum and what leave will mean to the funding and research. Throughout our history, Great Britain has produced some of the best scientists and best innovations around the world, from unveiling the DNA to uh, Newtonian theory, all the way up to recently the discovery of the Higgs boson particle. But often, when these topics are discussed in the media, there is a language that scientists use that is not easily accessible to many people. So this is a key area that would be interesting to work on and explaining some of these fascinating discoveries that everyone can access the true science behind them. So these are the ideas that I feel would be interesting to discuss on a wider audience and really spread the knowledge and make science accessible to everyone. Thank you for listening.